Welcome, this is Tony, aka the Retro Game Wizard, and today we are playing Call of, uh, Two Ta or some weird stuff like that. I'm not too sure. Uh, this is a creepy warning. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> this game was originally a book written by H.P. Lovecraft, who gets so into making his stories that he actually ended up believing them him what he wrote himself like all his creatures and everything so this should be a pretty twisted but good game I can imagine he was a damn good writer that's for sure I read all his books Call of Tithulu Dark Corners of the Earth I'm just calling it Kulu alright everyone okay with that <laughs> I'm hoping you are because uh yeah uh I I don't I don't know how to pronounce that but all right all the heroes die die let's start off I'm not going boy scout as that would probably be a little uh how you say it a little lame <laughs> and we are at Arkham Asylum I wonder if we'll see Batman here. <laughs> now, my hand, I can fully see. My last case opened in me a new fear. A real fear. A fear of myself, of what I am, and of what I've always been. All that I was is now lost. Hope, purpose, pleasure, all meaningless. I now walk in the shadows between worlds, and it is there I have finally glimpsed upon what lives in the dark corners of the earth. Oh, title reference already, what do you know? Whoa, look at his eyes, what the... Damn, that's, that's creepy, man. I guess. Oh yeah, there's some beats to dance to, eh? <laughs> How old is this? Or how old is it based in? Game tips are currently active. Okay. Six and a half years ago. Wait. Six and a half years ago. Hang on there. No one said anything about gunshots. Who have we got out of here? Eh, just 
just me, Nichols, and a few new recruits. Well, that's just great. Lead the way, Robert. I better check out this crazy gang of yours. Well, I actually get to move. Yes! Alright. Let's go! Hey, I said move. Oh, wait. Dang, it's one of these ones. Why can't they just make it so you can use the arrow keys? Seriously. Well, you're walking too fast. This guy apparently doesn't move that fast. Oh, let me hit him. Let me hit him. Fine. I think I saw him with Officer Armstrong. Evening, Jack. Glad you could join the freak show. Just cut him off. How's it looking, Henry? I don't like this one bit, Jack. Check the alley on the right. Victor Holt's over there in the shadows. He's waiting for you. Can we trust him? Nope, but we've got you covered. You better take it slowly, though. They're a bit twitchy. A bit twitchy, eh? Hmm. Oh, what the? I don't want to die. What you talking about, man? Let me move. Let me move. Run. Run. Jump. Jump. Whee! Jump in the middle of gunfire, eh? Right, let's see. Can we open this door? Yes, we can. The fire fire place. is still burning. Can I touch it? Can I touch it? Oh. <laughs> As I continue to translate more psychotic fragments, I become more and more eager to contact my Yithian masters. These beings truly are gods to us. Their intellect and knowledge surpasses ours in ways impossible to comprehend. I know now just how insignificant mankind is in the universe. A doomed and simple species thrown up as a side effect of an experiment by the elder things. It is a blessing that such flawed creatures as ourselves have such a short and limited future. How is that a blessing? <laughs> ah. Don't worry, I just said it made it to my journal entry. I've never actually played this game before, but... It's an old stove. Yeah. It's hot and giving off a lot of smoke. It's really old, eh? Die, you bastards! It's too dark to be sure, but that rotting smell tells me these shelves are used for storing food. Hmm. Very interesting. It's locked. Oh. That's, That's simply strange. Looks almost like a flaming eye. I should take a closer look. Yes, I should. This blasphemous image makes me feel uneasy. Uh, yeah, I wonder why. Now let me look at that. Like I said, let me look at it. Do I have to stand farther away? If not letting... There we go. Oh, what the... How... How is there a save on it already? I guess I'll overwrite it. It's at the exact same place, too. It's locked. Screw you, locked doors. Ooh, this one's open. Ooh. At last! <gasps> Thank you. Yeah. That was kind of a creepy death noise. I better keep my distance from the window, or I'll end up like this nut job. Hey! Hey! How's it going? How's it going? Hey! Hey! I'm up here. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the randomness. Uh, it's a little dark here. Oh, didn't want to jump. Poison, by the looks of it. E. I I'm not eating what he's having. A diary. This will make interesting reading. <laughs> what a dick. I think it's time for some good old coffee right about now. Don't shoot. I'm unarmed. Ah. We've been expecting you, Mr. Wild. Oh, MLG shot right Damn. there. He recognized me, and it 
it sounded like he was going to get on the level with what's going on in this joint. Oh, wait. I thought I seen something back there. Nope, that's the wrong one. I did. Key. A key. This should help downstairs. Good to know. How does he know downstairs? Uh, Alright. Sounds good. It's in here. Oh, it closed again. No, wait, I, cl I must have closed it last time. It's locked. Alright, so it's not for that one. What about this one? It's unlocked. It's locked. It's unlocked. Another key. This should fit the door across the hall. Good. I Good. I don't understand. I'm in all of these photos. Oh, so he all is. Of all of them. It must be some kind of mistake. Why would they want me here? That must be an old case. Something I've forgotten. Some screwball with a grudge, maybe. Think. Maybe, maybe. I've got to think. Alright. Thank you for letting me move. You... I can't remember your name now. <laughs> it's unlocked. Good. For nutcases, they seem quite literate. There are definitely some strange sounds coming from this side of the room. Yeah. I, I can kind of hear that. 